Every month, new patches come out from Windows that sometimes require a reboot. You usually get this wonderful message all the time. Windows 8 and Windows 7 can force a reboot while you're in the middle of working or left your computer in idle for as little as 5 minutes. In Windows 8, Microsoft also removed the ability to identify you to postpone reboots while you're actually using your PC, which can result for you to just restart your computer when you're running applications that do not even have the ability to save what you are doing. On this video, I'm going to show you two different methods used to disable the forced Windows Update reboots. You can use a registry key that works on all versions of Windows 7 and 8, or you can use a group policy that is very helpful in a corporate environment which a Windows domain so you can just blast the settings out to all the PCs on your network. The first thing you need to do is go to start, type in reg edit. Once you have selected the file, open, go ahead and expand it. As you can tell, the file is named registry editor. Once you have got there, go ahead and be sure that you select the H key underscore local underscore machine. Then select software, scroll down where you see policies after. After going to policies, select Microsoft. Then select Windows. Once Windows folder is there, you're going to have to create two others. Go ahead and right click on Windows and select a new key. Name this file Windows Update. Be sure that you don't put a space when you spell it. Once you've created this folder, go ahead and select a new key again underneath it and select it AU. After making those two folders in there and selecting the AU, go ahead and right click and select a new D word value. Name the file no auto reboot while logged on users. Once you have created that file, go ahead and select it. Be sure that you select the value as 1 for this file to work. Once you have created this file, you can now exit the registry edit. Go ahead and restart your computer and see if the wonderful updates will not make you restart again. If you want this file to come back on there, you would do the exact same way going to that location by going to reg edit. Be sure you go to the directions where you're at and just select the file again and change the value to zero. That will disable the feature from disabling the Windows Update reboot. On this other method right here, I'm going to show you how to use group policy to do this. First thing you do is go to start and type in gpedit.msc. Go ahead and select the file. Once the local policy editor opens, go ahead and move the file so you can see clearly. Be sure that you are on the local computer policy, then select computer configurations. Underneath there, select administrative templates. Then go to Windows Components, scroll down until you see Windows Updates. Underneath the settings, be sure that you select the no auto restart with logged on users for scheduled automatics. Once you have done it, go ahead and press enable. By enabling this feature, it disables the feature that will not reboot your computer for updates. If you want this file to come back, all you have to do is just go the exact same way by going to start, type in gpedit.msc. Go to your exact same places again as you just saw. Go to Administrator Templates, Windows Components, Windows Updates, and all you have to do is select the file again and just put Not Configured. So the one for Windows Update reboots could reboot back to normal again. And there you have it. 
This is how you disable the Windows Update Forest Reboot.